In the vast tapestry of mythology and folklore, there exist entities shrouded in darkness, haunting the fringes of human consciousness. Among these shadowy figures are the Pikachas, malevolent spirits with roots in ancient Indian lore. Join us on a journey as we delve into the depths of existence, uncovering lesser known facts of these enigmatic beings. The term Pikasha originates from Sanskrit, where it denotes a class of demonic beings that inhabit the realms beyond mortal perception. These entities are believed to embody darkness, deception, and temptation, wielding powers beyond human comprehension. While Pikashas are often overshadowed by more well-known entities in Hindu mythology, such as Rakashas and Asuras, they hold a significant place in the pantheon of malevolent spirits. Unlike some demonic beings, Pikashas are not bound by physical form, existing instead as ethereal entities that roam the astral planes. To understand the true nature of Pikasha, we must turn to the ancient texts and scriptures of Hinduism. Within these sacred writings lie descriptions of these dark entities, their origins, and their nefarious deeds. Pikashas are often depicted as shapeshifters, capable of assuming various forms to deceive and ensnare their victims. They thrive on human suffering and feed on the negative energies generated by fear, anger, and despair. In some traditions, Pikashas are believed to be the spirits of deceased individuals who were consumed by their own greed, lust, or hatred. Unable to find peace in the afterlife, they wander the spiritual realms, tormenting the living. But beyond their malevolent nature, Pikashas possess unique characteristics and abilities that set them apart from other demonic beings. Let's explore some of the lesser known aspects of these enigmatic entities. One intriguing aspect of Pikasha is their association with certain rituals and occult practices. In some esoteric traditions, practitioners seek to summon and control these dark spirits, harnessing their powers for various purposes. However, such endeavors come with great risks, as Pikashas are notoriously cunning and unpredictable. Those who dare to dabble in the dark arts may find themselves ensnared in a web of their own making, trapped in a deadly dance with forces beyond their control. Another intriguing aspect of Pikashas is their connection to the shadowy realms of the subconscious mind. In the depths of our psyche, these malevolent spirits lurk, feeding on our fears, insecurities, and unresolved trauma. Some scholars speculate that Pikasha serve as metaphors for the darker aspects of human nature, the inner demons that plague all of us. By confronting these shadowy forces within ourselves, we can gain insight into the deepest fears and overcome the obstacles that hold us back. The concept of Pikasha offers a powerful metaphor for understanding the human psyche. By acknowledging and confronting our inner demons, we can begin the process of healing and transformation. In many spiritual traditions, the path to enlightenment involves confronting and transcending the influence of malevolent spirits, much like the Pikasha. Through meditation, prayer, and inner reflection, we can cultivate inner peace and spiritual resilience. So as we conclude our exploration of the Pikasha, we're left with a deeper understanding of these elusive entities. Beyond their role as agents of darkness and chaos, Pikashas represent a timeless archetype, a reflection of humanity's ongoing struggle with the forces of light and shadow. In the ever-shifting tapestry of mythology and folklore, the mysteries of the Pikashas endure, waiting to be unraveled by those brave enough to venture into the shadows. So join us next time as we continue our journey into the realms of the unknown. Thanks for listening, and remember to like and subscribe. Thanks a bunch.